All right, guys. Um, so this is it. This is your ISM unit uh, from uh, 2007 uh, Geo 450. Um, I should be receiving a new one. Um, I purchased on eBay for about three hundred fifty dollars. There are other services out there for about one fifty to hundred dollars. Um, I think it's well worth just getting a new unit. Um, I do have this launch tool, or you could use a Mercedes Star. Um, one of those tools, you do have to reinitialize it once you put one uh, back in there. I'm hoping that's all she needs. Got this GL parked there for a while. It's in a great condition. Um, it's, it's really hard to see it in this way. Uh, I think the toughest part of... Um, this removal process was uh, getting the car up on the jacks to to feel safe underneath there. Um, other than that, I mean, we had a couple of brackets. Uh, they all came out right. The shaft, the one bolt on top of the shaft, I think was the hardest one. Uh, other than that, if you have the right tools to get to the 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 heat shield for the ISM unit. Uh, that will make a big difference. Um, I mean, otherwise you're gonna have you're gonna put a socket in there, and it's gonna be really hard to. Um, it's gonna be really hard to uh, uh, get in there. Uh, one thing you do want to do, you want to go ahead and disconnect the battery. My my battery is already drained out, so I didn't show you guys that part. Yep. So my battery was drained out. Uh, so disconnect the battery. Make sure the car is on. Uh, multiple jacks and ramps and have some good lightning if you're working indoors yeah that's about it man hopefully this help you helps you guys uh please do like and subscribe this video if you want me to make more of this content i know it is a little bit raw but um i am doing this in a, a real time from my house all right guys you guys have a good day thank you for watching